Hey you folks, Quill18 here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Railway Empire. We are in the release version. We're playing the Black Gold scenario for the second time after failing the first time. And honestly, we don't have a whole lot of time left to get to 60,000 people in Kansas City. Luckily, it is growing, and we're going to try to continue... Oh, it's leaning to windows. That's okay. That's going to happen a lot. I think it's going to grow and then shrink. Um, we don't have a whole lot of time. we got to get some goods over there. So it needs lumber, or rather logs. Oh, cattle car. I really want that tech. I'm saving up my tech points for that because we're going to start some cattle delivery soon. So we'll see what we can do. So, um, do I want to, yeah, right now, I mean, because it's 300 research points and we just paid like 50 grand for 80 research points via an inventor. So saving 300 research points by buying the cattle cart Keep auction. Your close and your enemies closer. Wonderful. That's us. So we've got that. Boys? That was a 300 point so tech. now? Very pleased with that. Um, more reliability. It's an expensive reliability tech. We might go and avoid some of the more pricey techs. Uh, we may as well get that. I do want some of the stuff on the south part here. See, what I can sort of see us doing is going through here, picking up the 10 wheeler, wheeler and getting the prairie for just really fast speed. Because again, we're mostly on flat terrain, so I'm not as worried about the tractive power. But that's 109%, which is pretty good. Mostly the, um, um, the elevations like the, the grades that we're gonna have to worry about with our train is gonna be from bridges from our little like crossover techniques over here, which do look quite fun and lovely. All right, so we got a little bit of cash, which is grand. We are going to run some rail down here and probably just a single line. Although, you know what? And then we've got the, uh, the, the vegetables over here. I mean, that's a long run, but we can keep like just slamming Kansas City with more stuff. So maybe I will actually run a double line down here with the idea of expanding out. Oof. It's a little bit intense, and we're going to have to do a bunch of crossover stuff, but that might be okay. We could sort of have, like, the double line that comes down here, or even, even sort of this way, and then have one spur that comes out to hit all three of these. That might not be the worst idea we've ever had. Uh, is there a way to restructure this? Sort of, kinda. Um, we don't want to have the trains going through Wichita if they can avoid it. Although, Wichita will probably want some of these goods too, but the priority is getting them to Kansas City. Later on, I mean, we could drive right through Wichita, but that seems, that seems very poor. So, what I'm thinking is right over here, we're gonna go and split off. Uh, so we've got to keep in mind that this side that I'm working on, this is the, um, the sort of line going north. So let me sort of split off this way. And yeah, we're going to land just sort of to the, to the left here of the cattle. Now that's 120 bucks. There's a fairly large bridge, but honestly, I think we're just going to go and eat that cost. So... Let's take up more debt, because, you know, that never went wrong. Um, I would like a lot more cash. I don't like the higher interest rate, though. Oh, I can, can I keep taking out these smaller ones? Okay. That's fine. Unless, again, I'm only concerned about the actual interest rate per month, trying to keep that as low as possible. Um, it means, you know, we, we're not getting as massive a chunk, but I don't think we need a huge chunk of cash. So we're going to pay to build that one, and then we're going to start the, uh, the track on the other side. Like this. At least this one won't be quite as expensive, because we've already paid for the base bridge infrastructure. So we're going to do that, and then scroll upwards. I don't know if there's like an ideal way to get this to go. To connect up. Um, I'm actually thinking about backing this up a little bit. Yeah, let's try this again. So what is it? Uh, shift click. Oh, which is basically going to remove everything. All right. Well... Okay, let me just try this again. So we're going to start from here, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop, say, back here. And we're going to have to pay for it now. 
And yeah, I think we'll have to take out more loans. All right, let's let's keep the game going because at least we're making some money. I'm, I keep wanting to pause because I'm really worried about the the Kansas situation. Bonus for for new industry. <gasps> San Antonio. But, oh, to build an industry here and then get a bonus, I guess. But I don't think that's where I want to be spending my cash. At least tell me that my trains are still profitable. Oh, they're still for they're still carrying goods for now. Although, I think this one's going... Oh, no, it's going to Collins Estate. For some reason, I thought that was a Salina over here. I'm like, it's going to Salina empty. No, no. All right, it's picking up plenty of stuff, and we do have a little bit of cash. So, where am I? Over here. We want to do a split off from this side. And connect over here. Somehow. Can I make a lower? No. Okay. Oops. I think I, I moved. I nudged slightly. There we go. Oh, and then you're not happy with that incline on your way down. Okay, there we go. So if we do that, and then connect you up over here, okay, then you'll be fine. 64 grand to do that, so we'll let the game run a little bit more. And then we'll get our double track going south over here. Where's the interest for the bonds? This is fine! We can just print more money! Alright, that's, that's the way it goes. And... Purchase. So there's a fairly intense incline there, but at least it's short. And I mean, it's not like it doesn't serve a purpose, I guess. So we'll want some more signals and things, but we're also going to have to build our little spur here. So what I'm thinking is, yeah, we'll, we'll set up like one of these T intersections over here, and then it'll split off into three for each one of these little things. Um, that way we don't have to mess with too much bridging. Saboteur available. I mean, conductors are nice, but we, we've got to keep spending on just track. I'm wondering temporarily... Actually, I think that's going to be an excellent idea. Um, I'm going to set up temporarily. I'm not going to keep developing the double track. I'll have them both join up. Yes, that's what we're going to do. So let's start with the lumber over here. And I think that's vaguely the, the right direction. I wouldn't have expected such a useless station, even from you. Shush you. Yeah, I really likes to... To just keep trolling you about these things. So you're going to go and connect up over here. And you're going to double track a scooch over this way. And then connect up. So that, that's going to have to get rebuilt later. Need some money. Money. Give me money. Thank you. Um, that's going to have to be rebuilt later. Because we're probably going to want the double track to keep going. Uh, but that'll be okay for now. So now we just got to wait for train money. It's only 30 grand, so it's not too bad. We got another research available. Oh, I can unlock uh, the 10-wheeler, which might be worthwhile, because it's a long route. Yeah, let's do it, because I do want to go in this direction. Oh, I think we'll use... The 10-wheeler is quite a bit more Does expensive to buy, as well? Hmm. And you know what? We're on a little bit of a time constraint, so let's just get started here. So, the purpose of this very long route is to get logs delivered to... Kansas City. And we will do that, yeah, because it's super expensive. It is quite a bit faster. Well, I mean, six miles an hour more, but it's also got the more attractive power. And I would like to use the Rogers 10-wheeler, but we'll use the American on this one. That's going to be fine. So you're going to go and get a bunch of logs and go that way. We could do multiple stops. Um, as long as you've got a full load, like, we're not going to stop at any of the other um, producers. Um, we oh no we're not the king of rail king of rail is the uh, the gangster guy we are the steel empire engine shed personnel so you're gonna do that and i want the milk thrown on here as well oh we're gonna need supply towers along the way here uh because that's a long way without any perhaps i will and i don't have any sub signals here i'm gonna set it up here so there's something sort of before that incline and probably another uh, over here yeah i better do that now because otherwise we're going to have some problems. Because this is going to have to fill up with water and sand pre or after this little incline thing here. Okay, it's good now. 
We may need one over here. In fact, I might just get rid of these two little sub-signals. Because um, they're not needed to set the direction. And replace that with another supply thing. But, I will wait. And you can see here, because of the multiple signals here, these trains are able to run together on the same track. I think otherwise there'd be a lot more sort of stalling and waiting going on. Now, that does mean that we are going to have a very busy uh, second landing over here. And so, what is this, Station Master? Oh, that's one of the office personnel that I can have. It draws up rule for maintenance processes and therefore reduces maintenance time requirements for all train by 5%. That sounds great. So we have someone in our office now. I'm very pleased with that. I think this supply tower should move because it's, it's going to lead to a few more bottlenecks. And yeah, I think I'll put another platform here. And what I'll probably do is tell my, like, these freight deliveries or something like that to use a separate platform from that one. Um, it might be worth doing that now. It's going to be, well, it's fairly expensive to go and set up the bigger station here. So let's get the milk set up first, and then we'll worry about setting up the, uh, the second platform. We will have to go and redesign um, our routes here. I don't know. Yeah, we'll do that. That's going to be okay. This is going to be slightly easier to merge up over there. Um, so I'm just going to get you to connect over there like that. And we will need some signals here um, to say only enter this little block if there's no one there. So you don't complete Pete with one another. And that's going to be a OK. And you've got those signals there. And that's going to be fine. OK. And again, I would like to buy the bigger train but it's not that much faster and i just want to get this going so deliver milk to kansas city done add locomotive to nyc american um and good okay so you're gonna have a full load of milk which is great so now the next thing i'll do is i'll add an extra platform in kansas city that i will use for um for freight or maybe i'll just move the passenger traffic to three like the passenger traffic like the, the train that does uh, Salina and Wichita, maybe I'll have it come in on platform three. Whichever. Uh, more research is available. Um, and it's still good to reduce these maintenance requirements. I would like the prairie. I don't this know how much it costs to like, buy this train. Thanks but for it's your work. a lot faster than the 10 reeler. Oh, someone stole a tech from us. Hmm. Oh, well. So, uh, not you, the station. We want to expand you. It's 100 grand which we had for a second, and then we didn't. Okay, there we go. Let's do it now. So that is the final expansion. Um, this really bites, but I think I will get rid of the supply tower here, because I think it's in the wrong place, because this is bottlenecking this entire block over here. Also, I should probably have a little signal right there. But yeah, it is It is not great. So I guess I'm going to have to demolish. That's 30 grand gone. Object is in use. Oh, because I think this guy is using it. And speaking of, a signal right here, like this, would be an excellent idea. New technology giant joins market. Huh? Market leaders enter alliance. All right. Can I get rid of it now? No. So someone's already signaled that, like, they want to use it. And I think it's this train. You can see, I guess it doesn't jam up that block there. Maybe it is fine, but I'm, I'm not convinced that it is. Okay, we're going to do that. And so from here... Can I not put the... Oh, there it is. and build and so now the trains that are Kansas City to Wichita I want to set up the rail line when you go to Kansas City you are just going to use track three although I guess they are smart enough to use either one maybe we're okay I think one of the very early builds it definitely didn't work it for me but maybe they will just use whichever one is open now and wouldn't that be lovely now you are waiting on someone. Waiting for Smith Breeding to Kansas City over here. I might want some signals here. The problem is if I put signals here, I think what will happen is trains will enter this block and then just wait. 
We're going to revisit this later and see if we want to specifically tell people to take certain branches. Transport P for freight. Oh, that's steel, which we're not really doing right now. Yeah, I'll, I'll just keep working towards the new train. Yeah, I'm not sure if they'll use both or I'm going to have to force them to use both. Or a specific one, I should say. You know what? Let's just, let's just do it. Um, so Kansas City, Wichita, I will actually change you so that in Kansas City, you will prefer track three. Done and done. And Salina to Kansas City. When you go to Kansas City, you will prefer track three. Done and done. Okay. And I think there's an implicit signal on each platform. So people will, while there's a train on platform two, I think a train will happily come in and pull in to platform three. They might have done that anyway, but... Okay, need more innovation points. Bad condition. Slow due to missing equipment. Oh, right, so a couple of things. I need to rebuild my supply towers here. Unfortunately, one of your trains didn't make it. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to bop these two signals, which aren't strictly required, and replace you with a supply tower over here. And likewise, I'll put a supply tower on that route there. So it's a little bit more stuff going on, but it might be for the best. So that one's just a random breakdown. Bad condition, but it's being serviced. Every time you go to Kansas City, you get serviced. And there, we have no trains that aren't going to Kansas City right now. I should have had this one go Wichita to Kansas City, just that the names all line up the same way. But let's ignore that for now. Uh, we do have some cotton here we could deliver to Kansas City as well. Uh, the Columbia. Sure, we'll put in a bid. Uh, which one's the Columbia? With your help, Kansas has grown into a real city. Oh, it's down here. Yeah. It's probably just another we one got it. of your I don't know. mistakes. But could it be that you just placed a bid? I did place a bid. So the cattle gets there. We could make money by delivering it ourselves. And I guess that would be a good idea. It turns out making money is probably a smart thing to do in a game like this. So let's go and get you... Connect it up over here. Oops, I actually need to buy the track. Thank you. And we're going to throw a little signal on there the other way around so that you wait over here. And um, that's a fairly short route. You know what? I will wait and make this one um, an actual better locomotive. Especially if we can get up to over here. We're just, there we go. We just have to wait two weeks. 40 points per month. We are 20 points off. When we get to the third star here, a little bit more interest. There it is. So we're gonna get the prairie. You can drive two six two. It's like a football formation, not a very good football yard. formation, but it could be. So young breeding to which? Oh, you can't. You can technically get there, but it would be a mess. I forgot about that. Uh, cancel. Hmm. Hmm. Connection bonus. Oh. We could build a dedicated line for this. I don't know. We already have this. How are we going to get... Oh, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to have this over here. Um, can you? You can. I mean, it's, you know, certainly more than a little wonky. But this is how you get to Wichita from the south. I think that's okay. I will go ahead and invest to expand the station here to a second platform. It's not necessarily that critical, but we'll have platform two be the one that services to the south. So you are going to connect over here, and that seems fine. That's to leave going to the south. So I'll buy that. And then we're going to want something similar. If you go here... You incline just up and over this track. Can I make it a little lower? And then ask... Oops, that's no good. Hang on, there's probably a better way to do this. I'm going to go... I'm going to have you there. I'm just going to buy that. And then what I'll do is I'll start from here...
There you go. And you work out the bridge for me. Okay. Lovely. Should probably do that a little bit more. And so from here, we do need some signaling. So you're going that way. And you're going that way. And the same thing here and there. And then you guys can just wait over there. All right, that's not too shabby. And with the fact that I don't have a ton of money left over, then we'll set up Young Breeding to Wichita. So you're going to come out that way. That's going to be great. And yeah, we'll just go. Yeah, this, the price increase isn't that much. But we will buy one more NYC American here. And we will now be delivering cattle to Wichita. Which was already kind of getting there. But Steel Empire. That's me! Expanding Men at work. Lovely. Um, it is 92... We did reach our population goal in Kansas City. So 94, we got to connect six cities to the network. That should be fine. Connection bonus for the veggies at Nolan's Farm. Yes, we will definitely be looking to do that. In fact, I think what we'll do is we'll work off the same little triple connection. Again, this will probably be done into some sort of like T-junction. Maybe actually this part will, will stay, but we'll have another, you know... T junction that goes off in some other direction, but hooking up the veggies would be nice because we know Kansas City wants it. Um, well, everything sort of wants it. We don't have any more growth requirements, but people do want some veg, so we might just deliver it in Wichita, and and have that be part of a thing. Actually, I don't think well, Wichita's grown a lot actually. And yeah, certainly we'll need money. Oh, forty-five thousand. But you're growing. Yeah, you'll hit the forty-five thousand. You'll demand veg, and then overflow vegetables might make their way to Kansas City. But we, meet, we met the growth requirements, so that's all right. So yeah, I will just go ahead and work off this little setup a little bit more. Can I not get you to come in here? Let me start from the bottom. There's going to be bridges. That's going to be really expensive. We might just want to sit on this and save up a little bit of money. We might want to repay some bonds as well. Onboard toilet, uh, number of passengers are more. Increase the top speed of your trains in bends by 20%. That's not bad. Loudspeakers, more ticket prices. I think I think we want a lot of this stuff. As our cities grow, we're uh, probably getting a lot more. Uh, 11 stations. Well, it's easy when you, get, you start with a bunch of money. Mm -hmm. um, we are going to get a lot more passenger traffic over here. We take a look at, say, Kansas City, Wichita. Oh, it's still just delivering meat. I think we're going to want more than one train over here. Yeah, and we've got tons of money. You know what? New train. We're going to new Wichita to Kansas City. Um, I could make it prioritize a particular type of good. I don't think that's going to be important. I will use the prairie, though. Now, this one might get stuck behind someone else. There you go. A little bit more passenger. We could have this one specialized to um, to express goods, since we do have the bonus for the passengers. But I think it, it does pick up the most valuable resource every time. Bonds mature, so we repaid some of it. Hey, that's fine. Or we repaid it. Um, so it, it, presumably that's train. the biggest money maker. We're bringing beer back. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with this. Do, 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 do. What's the mediator for? Identifies defects in objects being auctioned. Reduce the price of the next auction. Yeah, but it's going to cost 93 just to do that. And this the reporter we can use to screw now. someone else. Thanks for your work. Oh, you and your, your cheap and, ex and prevalent spies. Very annoying. All right, we still have... Oh, there's Fayetteville. You know, I think we'll get you connected up. I think what we'll do... Where is this ranch? Near Abilene? Oh, I can't scroll right now. That's fairly far south. Oh, that might be profitable. That's literally all my money. Be nice if you could interact with the map here and see if there's like um, a meat processor over here. I mean, we definitely want to expand to this area. Now, it's too far for now. I got to say no. And there's a meat processor. Yeah. Let's get Fayetteville because it's a decent uh, connection bonus. 
A small train station should do fine. And we are going to want some track construction. Now, do we want to double track all the way down here? I don't know. I think what I'm going to do is just get it to just connect up to the double track in here in some fashion. And that's going to be enough. Can I change the direction? Because I want it you to flow in this way. I guess I'd, I'd have to plop it down first. So I'm going to get you to plop here and in that way. So that is fairly expensive because it's a very long route. Now we might want to do some stuff with these goods later on, but I, th I think that's going to be okay. Did your connection bonus go away? Oh, did we already get it? What, what do you have here? Furniture. We got logs over here by Wright Forest Isles. We should be able to get the logs into Fayetteville quite easily from here. Oh, that's going to be a nice little business. And then we might be delivering furniture to Kansas City. Oh, I'm very excited about that. Increased ticket prices for passengers. Yeah, let's get more of that. And at the same time, uh, what's our new Wichita to Kansas City? Passengers and mail. So it's not just beer and meat anymore, presumably. We actually got a little bit more uh, passenger traffic, which is good. We could get more going with Sal Salina, but we'll leave it be. Connection bonus to what now? Oh, that's the vegetable farm. He's back. Well, let's finish this up. My God, that's expensive. And it's not bridges all the way, right? Oh, you're actually tunneling. Ooh. Can we? I didn't realize there's a big hill. That's what's going on here. If I move you over this way, A, that blocks the tunnel, B, no incline. Oh, that's so much cheaper. Okay. Uh, a little bit of that. And from the other side, over here, I'll have you split off and then ask you to do something like this. Uh, you're tunneling. I don't know. I guess that's fine. Tunnel versus bridge. Whatever. We don't actually have a tunnel yet. We're going to do it. Blam. Okay. Good. And we'll put a pair of signals. Boom and boom. Nice. And we'll need some supply depots. But before we do that, let's set up the new train, because I think... Yep, we have enough for the prairie. Excellent. Decent power, decent speed. So your rail line is going to be from Fayetteville to Kansas City. Go. First load. Oh, you do have furniture waiting. Oh, that's nice. Right, I guess you were close enough. You were probably getting some by... Um, just by, by land vehicle. Well, I mean, trains are land vehicles. Like, carriages or... I don't know. Horse-drawn stuff. So, hopefully that's fairly profitable. We actually might want to buy this business. Because we do have goals for industry profit. Don't we? Oh, maybe it's not. I think my old, the, the preview build required it, but it doesn't. we got to achieve freight revenue. We're working on it. Produce five loads of oil per week. But I don't think that's from our own industry. The Adams Family. Adams Chopping. Which is already being supplied by my competitor. You know what? 74 grand? Let's do it. I'm willing to bet that'll make a profit for us. Yeah, I mean, in theory, you're being delivered to Santa Fe. All right. And my competitors here are just using single tracks everywhere. Not much in the way of signaling, but they might be on the, the... Oh, they're on the easier setting. They're on the arcade setting where you don't have to worry about signaling. Ah, oh, they're cheating. That's fine. So, okay, Fayetteville, you've got something going back and forth. Uh, we will try to bid for some technology because it's nice and cheap to get it this way. That's going to be okay. Uh, let's go and put in some more bids here. And yeah, I'll be trying to get forest, right forest aisles over there. But the other thing I might want to do is just save up and buy that industry. You won the auction? 
But what are you going to do with it now? Yeah, I'll figure it out. Onboard toilet. More passengers. More speed and bends. I kind of like the idea of the speed or the lower uh, maintenance requirements. You know what? Let's have less maintenance Unfortunately, one of your trains didn't make it. Shush you. Okay. Oh, I got to put a cut in here, but... Now, you are, you are waiting for that, and yeah, so you're not automatically picking... Oh, no, we actually have both, uh, both busy right now. I see. And so you're not automatically picking an empty one, but that's not true. You do automatically pick an empty one. Alright, I think in an earlier build, they weren't doing that, but now they are, and that makes me very pleased. To the point where, what I'll probably do, assuming that it does really, truly work properly like that... I'm gonna grab you and try to get you merged into all this, although I don't think I left enough room. To make this work. Yeah, I'm not I'm not convinced that I have enough space. Oh, hold on. Right there. Or not. Oh. It's a little bit wacky. But boom. Trains can now use three platforms coming from the other side. Alright, that's great. And maybe I was wrong. Maybe it always worked that way, but I'm pretty sure in the early press preview build... Um, that wasn't functioning, so I'm so happy that it does now, because that's going to help our flow a lot. Do I want to keep getting the cheap texts as soon as they come up? Well, you know what? More speed and bends. We've got a fair number of bends. All right, let's put a cut in here. We are still going towards success. We do have to make sure relatively soon we do connect two more cities to our network, but we're not too far away from doing that. Um, oh, they're expanding out to Amarillo here. I think what we'll do is probably extend the double lane over here to the Lubbock and Abilene. Uh, Dallas isn't too bad either. Shreveport's going to be a little awkward because it's fairly hilly and lots of rivers over here. But I think that's it. I think what we'll do is we'll sort of tee up junction over here and keep going down in that direction. But I would really like to buy that business. I think it'll put it up to auction though. And I would prefer not to lose the auction to that business. Um, and then I'll get the lumber over there. But we may have to prioritize getting the cities hooked up uh, before we simply lose the scenario. Thanks for watching, folks. See you next time.